And welcome back. It looks like we've just gotten the new numbers just within the past couple of seconds for Sally. So let me bring up our uh, our graphic with all of the information. The 7 p.m. coordinates and uh, stats and so forth are in. Winds are unchanged at 100 miles per hour. The gusts up to 120, so that has, has been unchanged. West northwesterly movement continuing at a very slightly slower five miles per hour. So with some of these really slow moving storms, it's a little staggering sometimes to see them sit at two, three, four miles per hour. And right now this one is at five miles per hour. It was at six with the last advisory. So pretty much unchanged, just a tad slower there. Pressure at 988 millibars. And now it is 100 miles uh, east of the mouth of the Mississippi River. And so we are seeing it still with the west northwesterly movement, but so slow. So it will probably be we're now in that time frame where it will be hanging in this general area really for the next maybe almost 24 hours or so. It will eventually move, move to the north and that is a big concern. I understand for a lot of people when is it going to happen? So it does look like it may not come until tomorrow, but look at these models showing still just a little bit more westerly or northwesterly uh, continuation for a bit, but the turn is expected. We will have high pressure here guiding it eventually to the northeast and eventually a trough setting up to bring it out to the northeast as well. So those are the things that we're looking at as far as the steering, but right now for sure, the steering is not going to change very much. We have the high to the north. This would be the high gradually bringing it to the north and northeast and then the trough off to the west as well. So this is the thinking as of yesterday into today, really over the past several days, really since we started watching Sally, we were kind of expecting this general movement, but it is good to get a little bit closer in timing to the actual landfall and actual, uh, you know, uh, rival of Sally and see that these are still generally the things that we're watching as far as the steering goes and it does look like that should happen for a while. It was a question of when and where and that's still a little bit of a question, but as we get closer, certainly the uncertainty does tend to go down. And so that's thankfully what we're seeing with a lot of the models that give us a little more confidence. So note that it is expected to still perhaps be a category two, maybe potentially a low end category three, hard to say low end category three. That's it's a major hurricane, uh, but it does look like it will probably increase a bit more as it heads toward that landfall. The path is not changed at 7 p.m., but a new path will come out at 10 p.m. The landfall right now toward Mississippi or the Alabama state line, perhaps.